Like uh, yeah, we 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 have pick uh, from plane uh, that show the horizon drop with uh, the correct uh, the correct degree drop and so on. Uh, it counter a lot of observ observation. I, I I am not uh, I am not. Uh, you know that you already know that uh, everybody. Yeah. But uh, it it match it does not match what we observe uh, in reality. And uh, on this simulation, I don't take in account uh, the atmospheric uh, vision we we have, the atmos the um, spheric vision we we have, and I don't take in account the atmospheric uh, um, opacity that we can have. So it's only uh, full Euclidean geometric uh, representation of the globe uh, when we are uh, on a plane. Okay, it's clear. There is uh, every data, but uh, on this one, yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, it's a uh, 30k feet uh, for. Uh, it's a. Uh, it's. Um, in fact, uh, uh, the vast majority of plane of commercial plane don't uh, go higher than uh, 13 uh, kilometers, like uh, uh, 14, 40 feet, 40k feet. Uh, something like that maximum yeah yeah like forty thousand feet yeah. so um yeah it's a uh, good entry point because uh like i said uh the globe uh, yesterday said yeah we see the horizon drop and i was like yeah but uh, you you should see uh the fact that the earth is not uh, flat because we uh, he agree on the fact uh, we we see the the ground flat as fuck, but we have a limit of vision you know, and uh, on on this type of picture we can see I will add uh, add uh, some light uh, some uh, depth uh, sensation you know, uh, this we we can see the fact uh, there is um, I don't know. Uh, a good word in English to, to, to call that, but when you see the horizon drop, you should see the geometry of the ball. Like, uh, like everything um, is going um, to, to, uh, to compress, but uh, in an um, expo um, exponential manner, you know? Yeah, there should be there should be more curvature than there than there is at altitude. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I don't know how to explain uh, this correctly, but uh, it's like uh, yeah, we we see the horizon drop, but we never see the 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 curved shape over uh, over us, which is a nonsense uh, total. Like uh, the eye is not is capable to 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 see one type of geometric curve, but not the other, you know? Yeah. It's not clear. Uh, I, I'm sorry about that. Uh, I need to find a better no, way no, we're to... No, no, we're here. We, we get it. No, we, we, yeah, we got you. I assume you have multiple simulations then from the way this one is only one flight on one... one this is like one speck of the data that you represented in the picture. Can you repeat? Uh, I misunderstood some word. Uh, I'm sorry. I assume you have other simulations of all the other data, or did you just do this for like a small data set? Oh, it's um, actually it will uh, just uh, get my one uh, my uh, two million five pass, and uh, it uh, just uh, pass every plane uh, like that. <laughs> so every data is a uh, true data. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, like two, he's got like saved. He saved like two million. Um, uh, like, I, I, I will show you uh, the the mm -hmm. directory just uh, just for fun. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's a um, it's a representation of uh, of the plane on the globe, but it's not. It's a flight simulation. You cannot take control. Uh, you just put the flight paths on the software, and it will represent uh, what uh, what uh, should happen on the globe. You have some control, like uh, like I can uh, tilt uh, the camera, you know, 
uh, I have uh, the horizontal uh, tilt uh, right in, uh, in the left. So uh, I can uh, put my uh, eye of sight uh, at the physical horizontal level and uh, see that uh, it's approximately a three degree, degree drop at uh, 10,000 uh, kilometers. Um, I have some, uh, some other control, but uh, not, uh, not too much uh, useful. The, the better is the eight control I can uh, I can go uh, to uh, 30k kilometers, 30k, uh, 40k kilometers, sorry, and uh, it will uh, show that the drop is uh, huge, uh, really huge at this height, uh, like uh, nothing to do with the uh, Philips uh, Van Garvener jump and so on. It has nothing to do, uh, like, you, you, uh, your eye, uh, when you see that, uh, and I want to, to add, uh, it's complicated to, to add light on a huge uh, uh, 3D uh, representation because uh, the, the graphic card uh, is uh, in PLA, uh, in, um, uh, <laughs> how to tell, it's a huge, um, huge distance represented uh, in 3D, so it's not something that uh, we normally do uh, in, uh, in 3D representation. I don't know if uh, you are uh, familiar uh, with that, but every simulation uh, works in local manner. Uh, but here, uh, I have a literal uh, 600, uh, 6,000 uh, uh, kilometers uh, radius Earth. So when I add light, uh, my computer uh, is uh, breaking down. <laughs> <laughs> you know? So, so uh, I, I will find a way to, to add light, uh, maybe more local light uh, in order to, to give this depth uh, impression. And uh, we... The A is, um, I don't know how to tell, but uh, I am looking at this uh, picture from uh, day, uh, days and months now, and there is something odd with um, like uh, this, uh, this curved effect, this 3D curve effect that we don't see at all uh, in real life, you, you know, so. Uh, and what I can is uh, I, I want to do something with this software is uh, as long as it can take true fly pass. Uh, I want uh, somebody uh, in the flat art community when he takes the plane, he just give me the, the, register, the registration num number and I, I uh, like I download the fly pass and we can do uh, we can do some uh, comparison, uh, comparison video with my uh, simulation on his time lapse uh, fly pass. You know. That has potential, yeah. And, yeah, the, uh, thing that, the thing that was really damning uh, that he said earlier that uh, uh, we didn't get the first, I didn't get the first time was that you you tracked the speed of these southern flights to yeah. be over. A thousand kilometers. A, 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 what was yeah. it? A, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Hour? I, I yeah. will show you the the pic. Yeah. Uh, give me one second. Tac, tac, tac. Uh, I, I don't. Uh, 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 I, I will. Um, I will um, do this uh, famous uh, filtering on uh, every flight path because, like I said, uh, tac, tac, tac. Uh, application data. Yeah. Dude, this would this would make Ruhif like queef. That's so appropriate. I, yeah. I don't. Uh, can you repeat? I, I misunderstood. <laughs> I don't think that yeah, translated okay. well. It's okay. It, it would make us a there's little. A, there's, a, there's a. There's a. Yeah. You, uh, uh, there's a guy that that is always arguing long distance measurements with a the theodolite. That's something you could actually. Um, but comment no, like, on. Went through all the sixteen emergency landings, flight paths, and put them on. Yeah. I can do the the true the true and, and again if there is a more fly pass with emergency landing if I have um, no for now I am banned from uh, flight radar twenty four but uh, my uh, goal was to to create a full database uh, 
H24 connected to flight radar and uh, then uh, when there is uh, uh, an emergency landing, hop, 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 I get the flight pass, I put it uh, on uh, the IE map and I see, hmm. right. <laughs> you know, uh, right. like uh, no Glober can tell, uh, oh, you just uh, rewrite the flight pass uh, by hand uh, on MS Paint and so on. No, no, no. I, I take the latitude longitude of the flight pass from flight radar 24 and I put it on the, on the map. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> so, GG, uh, here is every uh, fly pass I get, so you can see there is a, it's only a matter of paint. There is no other data uh, than uh, than a GPS uh, dot on the speed and the altitude and azimuth uh, nice. to be short. So uh, here is it. Uh, this is uh, one of the um, screenshots I have made. Uh, I have three screenshots uh, for now where I Take uh, I have seen uh, this type of flight uh, on my uh, on my software, and uh, I was comparing uh, like the, um, the kilometers uh, given by flight radar and the the actual uh, speed. You know, um, here we can see uh, one thousand kilometers is the speed given by flight radar twenty four. And one uh, one thousand two hundred twenty kilometers is uh, the com computed speed I have done by the GPS dot. Okay, uh, there is the same problem with uh, this one. And uh, as we can see, the other uh, thing that is odd is only uh, seven hundred eighty-seven. Um, uh, minus nine, uh, minus uh, nine dream dreamliner do this flight. Every fucking plan is this type of plan, and um, and there is only uh, four, uh, only uh, six. Uh, I got I got only four, but tac tac tac. As we can see, there is this one the QFA QFA twenty seven. The LEN eight hundred that we retrieve here, and uh, I shut up this and uh, the TF, TFA uh, twenty eight. So uh, oh no, sorry. Back. So uh, yes, uh, useful uh, information that are under. Uh, as we can see, we lost them at some point. Uh, but uh, you already know that, uh, I guess. <laughs> so uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically, uh, like you're showing that the the the, the recorded uh, pings from the GPS are showing that the plane's going a lot faster than they report that it goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, we can see the differential speed between flight radar twenty four and the computer here. Wow. Right. Again. Oh shit! Yeah. What the fuck? Again. Wow. Yeah. And. Again here, and as we see, oh my god, bro! This Wait, one, whoa, whoa, whoa! It's uh, Sorry, uh, these are these are some thing, Listen, listen, because it's yeah. pretty interesting here. It's the same oh, day, same me? day. Okay, it's the same day, and mm -hmm. this one, this one was going. Uh, let me get straight. West to east, and this one was going uh, east to west. Look at the okay. differential speed. Like uh, maybe a jet stream? I don't know. Yeah. Let me uh, yeah. hold on. L let me show you this real quick and see where that lines up. Where is that at? Uh, let me two seconds. I... Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. I... How many Hesco Pascals is 40,000 feet? So, sorry. Well, 15, 19 kilometers per hour. Is that what it was? Or was it 13, 19? It's like 940 miles per hour, which is insane. Yeah, you need to do the. I, I don't have uh, done the automated uh, translation. <laughs> So yeah, uh, I I will uh, write it in the chat uh, just to be um, uh, like uh, if you want to 
check flight radar 24 and uh, then you 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 go uh, you you find uh, one of the, the uh, long flight pass uh, south flight pass uh, just check if uh, it's one of them uh, so l a n 800 l a n 801 l q f uh, no it's q f a only q f a q f a I didn't hear any of the uh, <laughs> This was a. Uh, this is the major uh, plane that do south fly, south uh, south flight. So. Here we are. Uh, I don't know if you have uh, other question or, or if I miss uh, something. Uh, new perspective. If you have. Uh, uh, yeah. You, you. What you wrote here is land eight thousand land eight hundred one. What's that? Those are the different flight. Um, what, uh, can you translate uh, thousand, that? Oh, thousand, uh, sorry. Oh, tac, tac. Yeah. Oh, 800. Uh, I okay. wrote, uh, the name of the plane, like uh, the registration of the plane oh, that okay. did the uh, flight path. And, uh, well, and what's like the discrepancy now? You're saying it, it, it rather, okay, so the, the flight data reported that they were going how many kilometers an hour compared to what you found out? Uh, can you read uh, on the screen now? No, it's pretty small to read. We can't. I can't uh, read it. Uh, so I can't read it. Okay, there you go. Just okay, so hey, shut up. It, we're talking <laughs> the difference of how many kilometers? Yeah, so uh, 300 uh, kilometers difference. And, uh, Everybody got sick and had to go through this one period. too. Yeah. But uh, like you see, what is interesting is that no, uh, this one was uh, radar, which east, uh, east to west, and it uh -huh. was 300 kilometers. was west to east, and it oh. was 300 kilometers more than the flight radar. Is that, yeah, yeah. The, the, the distance is too long for them to excuse it uh, as... Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The eight hey. uh, another rabbit hole. <laughs> this one. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. yeah. With the plane, uh, a plane uh, actually uh, get get the speed with the wind. And there is some uh, captor, uh, that some sensor that uh, just uh, read the current speed wind, uh, and you can only get the differential speed between the uh, wind and the plane. But yeah. uh, if you get your computation via GPS. Uh, you will have the true speed. Yeah, There's buddy, the... dude. That's what I was about to ask you, bro. Yep. Exactly. Yeah, Thank you. Thank how... you. Uh, so maybe uh, there's a... Um, how to tell? Uh, in fact, uh, I will speak uh, for myself. Uh, I am a scientific man, so uh, only way to, to, to present the data um, in a... How to say? In a in a scientific way is to to let be able to everybody to to double check uh, what I have done. So uh, mm -hmm. the first thing is to create uh, like open source uh, software uh, that can. Uh, uh, the first thing, like you said, is to share the data. Yeah. Uh, once you share the data, everybody can do computation on it, uh, so uh, there is no problem with it. Uh, but once uh, that is done, you can uh, you can uh, do open source or not uh, software. We don't care because uh, the important the important is the data. So, so the goal would be to um, take the calculations of plus or minus three hundred, and then map out the correct distances that way we could get like a, a like a real map kind of thing mm. it's uh i uh, already have uh, worked on uh, the subject in fact um i will uh to find some example. or like a rough draft uh, it... this is one like it's like uh, it's uh, just uh, an example. Uh, in fact, uh, I have an anchor line on the AE map. I reproduce this anchor line on a uh, uh, XYPEC map. That is, uh, uh, every distance is on scale, like you can see uh, with the scale line uh, uh, on, uh, on the screen. And in right. fact, I was uh, like using every line that uh, cross the anchor line. I put it by just respecting speed 
and azimuth and as i was trying to to create a, a map like that I try to find and uh, Lilton by, by Lilton, uh, as you can see, I will um, connect every fly pass uh, with, between them in order to create uh, a map. And uh, one I try to find uh, on I created. Uh, this is what uh, I go I go out with, but. In fact, we have a huge problem with these uh, things. Is that uh, over water we have a lot of uh, discrepancy uh, in Jupiter spin. Like it's fucking noisy as fuck, and uh, there is like uh, a lot of plane lost in uh, in the um, over the the water. Like. Um, is that is that over in in AE projection, or is that yeah, just no? Uh... It is it's uh, the the XY representation taken taken from the AE representation, but the plotted like you said, just respecting distances. Right. So uh, I started from uh, this line. Okay. And uh, it has built uh, everything uh, around, and we can see that uh, and, uh, there is it a has connection build, uh, problem. Uh, uh, the more we go uh, um, at long distance from the origin uh, point, the more there is uh, some connection problem. This plan, this plane here, should be uh, like uh, landing air or some uh, something like that. So uh, it's a more accurate uh, distance representation, but uh, we don't know if uh, over water, how to say, uh, I don't know if the ping I have over water is the true distance. It can be faked. Like uh, I measure the, the, the differential speed, but it may be because the GPS ping is not done at the true distance of the plane. I don't know if I am clear. Uh, it can be like um, like if uh, on uh, this part of uh, of water, or uh, even uh, on this part of water, of uh, even on this one where uh, I have a lot of loss uh, of plane uh, on this part of water. Uh, it can be something like uh, there is some GPS uh, dot that are coming from not the true position of plane. Thus, it will um, fail. The I, I will have uh, not the correct uh, computation speed because maybe GPS is fooling me with this data on this part of the globe. Well, it, it could again? also be. Go ahead. Sorry. Yeah. Why would it no, be no, doing no. that again? <clears throat> Explain. Yeah, uh, you want me to read it? Sorry. Yeah. Why would it be giving a different reading though? Right. Because the the measurements uh, to, from it to, would be, be accurate. To, to add to add the the um, the distance um, the distance distance uh, difference between the globe and the the flat. You yeah. Know? So, well, so they can, as I said uh, uh, yesterday, uh, yesterday for me, <laughs> uh, uh, I have a, a really, really precious GPS dot uh, over land masses. Okay, but uh, as soon as we are uh, over the water, it's shit. So I cannot trust. Um, the distance given by uh, the GPS dot over water. It's a, it's a huge problem to to replot uh, in order to replot the 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 plane in a in a XY map if I can tell uh, because of that because uh, I am not sure about the distance between two ping in G between two GPS ping over water. Uh, as you can see here, we have a pattern that. Uh, how the fuck this pattern is possible? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I mean well, what, I, what I was thinking is that they, um, 
they could absolutely <laughs> cook cook the GPS and model it in those areas exactly. to spit out um, a, a different result. Exactly. Based on it's the input. like you have, you have the true model of us, and you want to, to fool people like uh, you need to fool distances and so on. You can uh, use the water to do that without any problem. You, right. you can't. You cannot do that over land, and this is what uh, I observe. Like every um, pass on land is a uh, like natural pass. I don't know uh, if you like it's. Uh, yeah, there is multiple plants that take uh, the same fly pass, but they divert. It's uh, it's um, randomization things. Uh, you know, you know, it's a statistical uh, repartition, uh, statistical repartition. So, so it match what I accept to see uh, with fly pass. You know, but over uh, over water, uh, nothing uh, like that. It's like the GPS is snapping on on some uh, on some uh, preferred uh, position. You know. Mm -hmm. Cooking I, I, the data is what they're doing. Yeah, and there is some flight pass here that is really interesting because uh, if I uh, plot the true flight pass, it will go straight like that, then turn a little here, and straight, straight, straight like that, uh, and turn here on the straight. It's like it, it's anything but the grid circle on the globe. Yeah. So, uh, and there is uh, some flight pass over the North Pole, but um, I have some failed. Uh, this one, uh, I guess this one is just failed, but uh, I need to double check uh, this part of the globe. I have a huge, huge, huge loss of plane here. On this uh, era, on the on this uh, ah the North Pole is here, um, and there is some planes I go over. Uh, I need to to check uh, this plane. Uh, I have a problem because uh, Flight Radar Twenty Four is not able to give me uh, data on this part of uh, of the of the map, but I want uh, that to be clear for everybody. Uh, this one can only be due to the way uh, they have done the, the um, databases. Some databases as, are not able to, to, uh, to correctly dispatch uh, data on this uh, era. Yeah. Because uh, uh, it's uh, latitude, uh, longitude representation is uh, azimuthal representation. So there is um, complicated things for programmers. Uh, when you are dealing with trigonometry data and you are putting it in a thing that uh, work like uh, proportional data. I don't know if I am clear uh, about this subject, but uh, you know, it's uh, not everything is done to hide something. Uh, some, uh, at, at some moment, uh, it's just uh, the difficulty to, to program things that uh, can uh, show you this thing. Uh, I don't know if I am clear. No, Not yeah, everything you... is due to, yeah. to, to hiding uh, voluntary things. It's just um, sad because uh, it's, uh, it, it's, um, it's cool for the globe uh, proponent. We cannot have data on this <laughs> part of the globe, but... Uh, it may do just uh, because of difficulty uh, uh, of programming difficulty is what they mean. Yeah, if they wanted to solve that problem, they'd solve it. They don't on purpose. They don't want any data out on the North Pole, I don't think. Yeah, like having a camera on the moon. They just don't yeah, want like, it. Li 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 yeah, like if you if you Google like shipping routes and you Google, I think it's called the Eastern Passage or the Western Passage or whatever. It's like right up through Greenland and all that. And <laughs> On the Wikipedia, they show you this like uh, image, you know, satellite, quote unquote, satellite Im overhead imagery of it, and the fucking North Pole is literally blocked out. Yeah, it's, every it's fucking peak I have seen uh, for, from the North Pole uh, have a, a huge, a huge uh, circle uh, over the North Pole, uh, a CGI circle uh, added over the North Pole. Yep. 
they, they blink out the Antarctica too. It's not just the North Pole. Yeah. 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 yeah true. True. Uh, on uh, Google Earth, you can see the, the circle over the Antarctica. Yeah. There was exactly. actually um, a guy that came forward. I think he was on Globebusters. And uh, he said that he was sent to Antarctica to map um, different locations. And he thought it was really strange how everything was just blanked out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's, um, it's amazing. Uh, it's uh, things that uh, let you go, hmm, <laughs> it's odd. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, yeah. And uh, there is the grid pattern here. Uh, that uh, I change uh, just uh, it uh, pop up in, in my mind. So I share it. Uh, it's like um, I, uh, you see the drawing pattern, yeah, like yeah. a concentric circle, you know. <clears throat> this one can lead to things that uh, every GPS ping. Uh, are done by uh, ground tower based because uh, when we see over the fronts, uh, like I uh, show you, it's a uh, go up here. You can see the the grid here, uh, here, and we can see the exact same things over the United. So those are all uh, all airports, right? So yeah, the yeah. Red, the red lines so, are airports. The red, uh, the, the red part. The red part is where I have a lot of GPS ping, and I oh. have a lot of GPS ping over the red part. <laughs> it's uh, simple as uh, I put a, a pixel, a, a blue pixel, uh, every time I have a GPS ping, and every time I rego on this uh, pixel, uh, I color it the more uh, red. Yeah. Uh, um, ooh, it was uh, hard to explain, but uh, I don't know if you have uh, understand. It's a heat map. Yeah, heat map. Yep. <clears throat> so, um, so uh, here you see that, uh, yeah, the statistical uh, repartition of the GPS ping is drawing this uh, famous pattern. And this famous pattern, uh, we can see that there is two concentric points uh, that draw a um, conver convergence line, uh, you know. I don't know if you can see it, but it's go like up. Yeah, it's curved. Like that, like that, and like that, like that. You see it? Uh -huh. And uh, I don't know how to, to, to do some filtering to retrieve the exact point of the convergence line, but we can see, we can see it converge uh, on this IRA on on this era, and it can totally be two tower, uh, two reference tower for the GPS. Like, look here. The more we 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 go uh, at distance from the um, from the so-called uh, possible tower, the more the pattern is uh, expanding. You know. I don't I don't know if it is it is clear uh, in your screen. Because, it's a, uh, it's a little blurry, but I downloaded the image, so I'm gonna have to. It's it's yeah. a it's just a very large file. So yeah, it's yeah, yeah. A minute. You you need a good computer to. to well, I have it. a I have a good computer, but the the gif gif images they don't they don't load very quickly. I gotta <clears throat> maybe I think maybe I'm gonna convert it or something. Uh, it's a PNG, not a gif. But uh... or uh, sorry, yeah, whatever, whatever it is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's just a format. Uh, so we have some uh, some pattern uh, here that is more, uh, not here, not here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, more obvious pattern. Now, where where is that on? Can you zoom out real quick? That is, uh, oh, okay. That would be uh, New Zealand. New Zealand, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So oh yeah, I think so uh, I have done a lot of explanation. I don't think I forget the data. But uh, if you have a question, 
Good, good. <laughs> um, I'm I'm good. Anyone else have questions? I'm I'm no, just excited. Just, yeah, I'm excited, man. See where it goes from here because this is awesome that you were able to get all that raw data. Yeah, I, it, it's part of my job. <laughs> so, so uh, I was like, uh, okay, uh, nobody has done that. Uh, people are struggling how to take the data, how to. Yeah, I have seen the, the work on the emergency landing and so on. And I was like, okay, I have a flight radar 24. It's a huge bunch of data. Go. <laughs> Just go. And uh, let's see what uh, it will show, show us. Well, you know what I don't see? I don't see any plane flights that go around the south southern hemisphere. Yeah, uh, so um, what you... There is, there is, but uh, uh, there is uh, so little... I have so little dot on the south that... Um, how to tell? I need to do uh, um, uh, contrast things between... Uh, between uh, uh, um, localization where I, I have a, a lot of GPS ping data and localization where I have not. So so uh, it's not uh, that uh, there is none. It's just that the there pixel... Varies. There's oh, like two oh, or three. Oh. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, you... Uh, I don't have uh, on this data. My um, my uh, software was like, uh, no, there is just one. So I will not display it because of contrast things, you know? Mm -hmm. Because if uh, if I do the contrast to display it, uh, it will be uh, like uh, burn here, only red here. Right. You know? So uh, I, I, it's uh, just a matter of cursor of uh, you know of uh, of the power of color cursor. Uh, it's um, proportional things on the number of ping on the color of the pixel. So so here. Uh, I have like uh, hundred and hundred uh, ping, you know, and uh, when it's blue uh, like uh, this pixel here, it's like uh, twenty, uh, maybe ten uh, GPS ping. So where uh, I have only one, it will not display. But uh, so it's so I will. Huh. Yeah, uh, look, look, look. I found. I found. Yeah, yeah. I found some too. Yeah. Yeah, it's just the contrast is so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just uh, <clears throat> that's okay. You look, look at that. Uh, how the there is a just it's too weak, too weak of a flight pass. Too weak of flight pass. Look at the north. Look at the south. Uh, I mean, it's uh, mind blowing. <laughs> and how, like... how uh, you said hmm. so? How how long was this data collected? Uh, two week. Two weeks of data. So in two weeks, this is how many flights are purported or, or claimed that have gone over these areas. Exactly. Okay. So let's see. I'm going to zoom in. So I see two paths right there. One that's... So in two weeks, I see... I mean, I see maybe a dozen flights yeah. in the south. Yeah, yeah, it's what I have seen uh, too. So that's right. nothing. That's nothing. <laughs> but on the global, what? Oh, there is flight every day on the south. <laughs> oh fuck, man. Yeah, well, you know what? Maybe, <laughs> maybe it's one flight a day that they fake. Yeah, just to, uh, uh, just to keep it real, you know. Yeah, on average, uh, I have seen barely uh, two flights a day. Barley, yeah. and uh, I am optimist. What did I miss? Well, we found out that they're lying about the speed of the planes in yeah. both directions right. by about 300 miles per hour. <laughs> 